The third-ranked College of Southern Idaho volleyball team has been on the road the first two weeks of the season, only losing once to the hands of second-ranked Iowa Western. CSI serving hard all night long, and they say that serve and serve-receive were issues in their loss. You definitely couldn't tell tonight. Now we we'll get the ball back as Tawana Danielson gets a nice pass, has a back set, the player of the game, Alexander Espinoza, one of her 10 kills for the night. Natasha Savovic serving again for the Golden Eagles. Treasure Valley overfeeds. And don't set it up for Espinoza. She will just destroy the ball. And that she does, once again, not even playable. We continue to focus on the third set. Jamie Solene serves one into the danger zone. And short middle TVC can't return. The College of Southern Idaho wins this one 25-10, 25-7, and 25-12. We wanted our setters to implement our middles and rights a lot more, and I think that um, Alex got the ball, and that's who we've been wanting to get the ball to, her, Alex, Potts, and Tristan, and I think that the setters did a good job of delivering it both to our middles and our right sides and running the offense that we want to run. I'm feeling pretty good. I'm glad that we won the match. Uh, it's a good start, especially at a home game. Uh, I really like playing with teams, and I, in all, I thought everybody played a really decent game. And everybody got to play, which was awesome. And it's awesome to put in everybody and still stay consistent. Kawana Danielson added 12 sets, while Selene recorded 14 sets. Total team blocks for CSI were 10 compared to Treasure Valley's 2. None of the Treasure Valley girls recorded double-digit kills. CSI hosts the Star Corporation Invitational starting Friday. Turning to the prep ranks, the Hanson.